So, what we're normally getting a winner's finals slash grand finals match, we're getting in two quarters instead. So, very interesting bracket how that worked out, but going to Smashville game one. Uh, I think the stage is really good for both of them. Obviously, uh, Goblin can get the early jab back air, kill confirms or his side B kills, and, you know, Rob does his side B BS and, you know, gets a kill at 40, but focusing on the actual game here, uh, Goblin finding his hits really well. Ooh, interrupting the Nair there with its own Nair, nice stuff. I really like that recovery from uh, Gabriel going high to avoid the ledge trapping scenario. Even got, uh, somehow found a hit on Goblin during it. But going, oh, going high again. He does get punished that time though. Goblin running too far. Jab because dodge through it. Ooh, that was really good. That was a weak spot. Sour, sour spot up air. You have air. Finding a kill. And a goblin? I mean, uh, Gabriel has a little bit of ground to pick up. However, he does find like a grab. Can get that kill. Like there. See the mash? Oh, that was a really good wait from goblin. Waited the first up tilt, and the second up tilt, it looked like uh, Goblin was too high up, so Gabriel couldn't get the up air follow up. I think Gabriel was looking for a uh, down tilt dash grab, but. Oh wow, Ga uh, Goblin actually lived in that time. Because uh, Gabriel went just went for a uh, raw up air instead of trying to do the up tilt on the up air. I'm actually not sure if uh, up tilt the up air works at like, relatively high percents, like 150, but. Yeah, Gyro. Uh, Goblin didn't really have a choice there. I guess he could have probably neutral air dodged the FB, but would have been in like air position for Gabriel. But, but I really like that up B from Goblin, just uh, stopping before Gabriel could get anything uh, flowing like a Nair, probably, out of Gyro, because that works a lot. Light strapping, nice up tilt. Nice parry on the Nair. Kind of weird firm there, Jair to do a down smash, but I think it's based off the tech they do, because Goblin neutral tech. The DI from Goblin not dying to get to the air, but Gabriel does catch him on the platform of up smash. Gabriel threw the Gyro the wrong way. Unfortunate, but still at decent. Two I he's gonna ran die to a random hit, but if he does get jabbed to, uh, he dies already. If I was Gabriel here, I'd just camp my heart out, because you just do not want to approach, uh, Roy at these percents, and you have really good camping tools like Gyro, Holy Space, Nair, or just, like, retreating back air. But, Goblin does find the, uh, bear in the, or the forward toes to scramble. Gyro interrupting the combo, but then does hit with it, and there it goes. Yeah, and uh, it looked like Goblin tried to air dodge there. It's something I learned, which I always thought, but then the Dwang thing confirmed that if you're mashing air dodge like towards the stage because you're getting knocked towards the blast zone, if you're like right on the edge of the blast zone when you're mashing air dodge, it actually you, like you. Air dodge directionally, it like pulls you away, like so, like towards the blast zone, before actually air dodging. So, in that pull away, if you go into the blast zone, you die. But that's what happened there. I always, it always looks like it kind of sucks you in. Sometimes, sometimes you just air dodge in, and sometimes has, it does like the suck in, like that. And uh, yeah, ooh, doesn't get the dare. FD kick from. Goblin. Little interesting. But, I mean, 
I'm not really good at analyzing FD because I just never picked the FD because it's bad for Snake. Not sure what happened there actually, I wasn't not actually sure, but not, not a great position because Goblin's getting combo now, but does find his way in. Doesn't get the tech raid. Nice carry in the air, however, no punish. He might have been slightly too far away. This is the air dodge, but Goblin can't really punish because running off stage to uh, Edgar really isn't that great of a choice for everybody. He does get out of the up tilt. Does die to downs. But Gabriel in really good position here. Obviously, the uh, optimal play is just to camp the lead, but uh, Gabriel doesn't even really need to deck these up two stocks anymore. He seems come up. Doesn't kill, but really bad position. Not sure if it's technically a sour spot, but Dare sending towards the stage instead of down. Spike ankle. And uh, Gabriel's just in a really good position here. The unfortunate SD and just been playing somewhat of that. Yeah, it really has happening early and down through a bear. So it's one kill confirmed. And yeah, uh, fairly decent 2 out coming out of Gabriel and Scotland. So this bracket's gonna be really interesting because. Because balls and Diz and there's finals. I think it's it's like Gabriel and someone else. Perkin. Perkin or Alois, I think. Or left.